Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to easily manage your game servers on Windows servers with Ultimate Game Server Control Center by Brainless Technologies. Today I'm going to show you how easy the installation process of UGCC is done by using a tool called EaseUGCC. It's uh, available for both Windows and Linux, but on this video we'll focus on the Windows server. First, we connect to our Windows Server via remote desktop. I'm using a virtual machine with Windows 2019 uh, demo edition here, but you probably have your own server already set up with a valid license key by your preferred hoster. As well, as you can see, my Showcase VM is a clean and fresh install, but you're also welcome to install UGCC on a server which is already in use. The next step would be downloading EaseUGCC, but Internet Explorer on Windows Server is blocking downloads by default. So to change this, we're heading over to the Server Manager, Local Server tab. Here on the right we can set the advanced security configuration for Internet Explorer, which allows us to download EaseUGCC in the next step when setting it to off. Now we're heading over to Brainless UGCC's download page. The link is also included in the description down below. Here we choose EaseUGCC, not the version for Linux there below, but the normal EaseUGCC, which would be for Windows. After download, we can run the installer directly from the browser or by switching to the downloads folder and double clicking the application. We are kindly asked if we want to run the installer and since we want to do so, we click yes here. After some extraction, this panel comes up and this gives us all the necessary options for the installation. I'll leave the default path and port here, but it's up to you to choose something different. As well, you can set the database type to MySQL instead of integrated SQLite database and provide and test your credentials on the database tab. You can disable the integrated FTP server in the installer if you want to, but I'll let this activate it for now. Then hit install and wait some time. You can see the progress of the installation down on the bottom. After the installation is done, your standard browser will have two new tabs opened. The first one is this readme document, which I recommend everyone to read, but I will skip it to keep the video a bit shorter. If your browser doesn't open the second tab, just try to reach localhost slash check dot ASPX and allow the browser to ignore the not valid SSL cert. This installation test page should show uh, all tests passed message. In case you get an error here, just put it in the comments down below or visit the Brainless support forum or Discord. You'll find links to these down below in the description as well. Now I'm going to log in by clicking login and entering the credentials admin and admin. On the first login after install and upgrade, the database update might be triggered. After the database update, you must click the button down here and log in again. On the first login, we also need to accept the license agreement and that's it, we installed UGCC completely and can now create game servers, request a license, set up user accounts and yeah, many things more. But we'll focus on that in other videos. But before you're leaving the video behind as far as you can now, keep in mind there are still some useful things you should do after installation. Click on profile, update my theme and so on. And then change your password since admin admin is a big security issue. Apply changes by hitting save after typing in your new password twice. The last thing I want to show you in this video is the game definitions web update function, which is also recommended to be run after installation and every update. Go to settings game types and scroll down to the bottom of the page. Click Web Update Preview, which will show a list of new predefined configuration values, which will keep your life as server administrator a lot easier. Click Web Update to apply the update. And that's it for this tutorial.
If you enjoyed it, leave a like and consider a subscription or writing a comment. And if you want to learn more about setting up a specific game server or other parts of UGCC, check out our playlist or suggest a missing game or topic in the comments. And please don't blame me for my accent. <laughs>